So I'm Olivia and I'm in my final year at La Trobe studying to be a nurse. And I'm Jordan, I work underground in the mines, um, gold miner. We yeah. both do shift work. We both do shift work. <laughs> Day shift, night shift and evenings. So we built the Santorini 25 with the Mirage this side? Yeah, Mirage yeah. side. When we were looking for a builder, we wanted a regional builder, someone who knew Bendigo and knew what sort of home and style and conditions Bendigo had and, and would work to those. So we did a lot of walkthroughs through a lot of the display homes and we came across Metricon as their finished design, finished touches were really well done. It was, yeah, it was nice. We couldn't fault them on a lot of their products. We chose a master in the front because it gave us this big, big lounge room scape that we've got here with the kitchen. It all kind of flowed together. It makes it a really good entertaining house, being able to go from the butlers to the kitchen. And we have quite a few mates over. Yeah. yeah. That's probably... Always entertaining as well. We, yeah. love, we love having a mates over. New house, big house, a lot of friends. <laughs> and it yeah. meant that we could shut the back half of the house off rather than having it open all the time, which was important yeah. for us for shift work. We needed to be able to shut half the house off, so keep it quiet. Sort of separate, but we're all together, which is really, really nice. I love the high ceilings and the wood floors in this home. I think that's something that we both wanted and we didn't think was possible until we walked through this home. It's open, it's bright, but when we want to sort of shut the house down in the evening, it's, it's equally as bright. We love that, the upgrade pack we did to just lift it all up, the bigger doorways. It really makes it a much, much grander house. That's what we love about it. We've lived here, well, in the area most of our life. Going to school here, so we love it. The new estate was location, location, location. Yeah. It was, it's so close. There's a really big um, soccer oval and park just down the road. There's a train station close. We've got all these regional things that, yeah, really come within walking distance. And the shopping centre. Yeah. And public transport. Public transport to this part of Bendigo is actually quite new. Yeah. So that was really a selling point for us. Yeah. The estate brings it all together. It means you're, you're like a little hub, you've got everything close by. Yeah. Being a new estate, we've got everyone that's all starting out the same. They all just want to start off in their brand new home, so we're all doing the same thing. Yeah, it's good. It's good. Our personal style would be modern coastal bohemian, but a little bit Australiana. So there's a lot of natural flowers, natural textures, but that really light, bright coastal feel at the same time. We found the first home buy and building process. It was. It was big, daunting, yeah, but <laughs> there was a lot of support through Metricon. Um, there was a lot of help that we got back on all our choices and decisions. Um, just confidence boosting by everyone, but it is scary. Um, but yeah, no, we did it and yeah, we're proud of it. At the time of deciding to build our first home, we were renting and our rent had just gone up. And it was at the yeah. point where we were both like, we don't want to pay someone else's mortgage. So you something had to give. <laughs> we just bought the bear essentials and put in the extra effort and I think we just saved our deposit within eight months of deciding yeah. that we were going to build. Okay, yeah. this much of money is going away because we're getting a house. <laughs> so we sticky taped our floor plan to the back of our door and it was a constant reminder that this is why we're doing this. My advice would be to, to stick with your guns. Focus on that end goal of actually getting in. Um, it's a long process, it takes as long or as quick as you want to make it by saving up. So. Yeah, really, really stick to your guns and just keep following through. I was here alone for probably four hours and I think I just walked around the big empty house being like, oh my God, this is ours, like, wow. And there was a few rooms I walked into and I was like, that is so much bigger than I thought, even though I'd seen it the week before in the walkthrough. Stood at the door with a big bunch of flowers and was like, this is ours, like, it was nuts. <laughs> Yeah, the first experience walking in that door was just unreal. Seeing all these empty rooms, thinking of what potential we could do to <laughs> make it ours now and not just a house, and make it our home. So we want to we want to grow a family here. So see see where the family goes. And it's built to grow with us. It's, yeah, there's only two of us, and it's a big house, but it's built to grow.